today we're doing something different. Yeah, yeah. I'm you are the, here. Yes, I'm here in the camera. Normally you're behind the camera. Right. So what are you doing here? Uh, I just want to join the fun, bro. I see you always do the gear of the day, right? So I'm I like, see. hey, like so fun, ah, to talk about the stuff. I like to share with the fans and the followers of the guitar shop. We have, after many requests, mm -hmm. we have finally got this guitar in. Martin D28. Right. This is like the most sought after guitar by most gigging musicians. And a lot of my customers have actually asked for this guitar. So, okay. Well, guys, we have finally have it here at the guitar shop. Yeah. Right now. So make sure all the people who ask for the guitar, make yeah, sure they come you, and try. Huh? Yeah, for you guys. <laughs> when yeah. I say we have one here, it means yeah. we have one here. Right. And I've checked my sources. This is the only piece available in Singapore at this point of time. BNIB. What's BNIB? Brand new in box. <laughs> okay. This is what we're talking about. This is a brand new piece. This is not pre-owned. This is a brand new inbox, uh, brand new like hard case, mm. uh, Martin D28. But this is based on your sources? Uh, yeah, this is based on uh, my sources. I did some what, research over the weekend. To what, find kind of, what kind of sources like uh, mayo, mayonnaise, tomato, uh, chili sauce? Actually, I uh, was talking about, you know, rompa rompa. <laughs> I like the rompa rompa. <laughs> what I can tell you about this guitar, I mean, I've played this guitar a couple of days already, so. I find it's, it has a very boxy sound, okay. a very woody sound, like, you know, if I was like... I know most of our, our fans out there, you guys normally use the elixir strings. I'm just sticking to the stock strings that came with this guitar. So these come with the Martin um, SP strings. These are the gauge 12s. These oh. are the stock strings which actually come on this guitar. Okay. Yeah, so I didn't modify anything. So maybe it may, the guitar may sound different when they have elixirs on them, but yeah. I'm just letting you guys hear the stock sound. So this is a Sika top. This is a Sika spruce top. Um, Indian also back and side, mm. so this is definitely for a high grade because the D28. Ebony bridge, that's for sure. Mm. These are bone pins. This is very nice. I actually like this black, I mean these are white bone pins yeah. with the red dot. Um, the fretboard here, we're dealing with ebony here. This right. is real ebony here, okay. And uh, construction wise, this is a dovetail construction. You guys are wondering whether this is like bone or stuff, but this is actually plastic for you guys. Oh, the binding. The binding. It's so like it's plastic. plastic binding. Yeah, okay. it's like a plastic right. binding. Right. Yeah. We have seen some D28s coming to the shop here. I've done mm -hmm. a lot of restringing for these kind of guitars. Over time, this this white uh, binding actually mm -hmm. turns kind of yellowish. So yellowish. Yeah. yeah it looks kind yeah. of beige kind of yeah. stuff. Yeah. It somehow, like indicates like I think how old the guitar already. You know? Yeah, yeah, right. It indicates yeah. how old the guitar is, and <laughs> it's a very. Yeah. It gives you the age look. Like. But I've seen this guitar when they age, man, they look mm. orange. They don't look this color. Oh, orange color. Okay. I've seen a 2004 D28. I see. I restrung it like that two months ago. My God, it was orange in color. I was like, whoa. Oh, yeah. But the sound is fantastic. Yeah, I think they, I think the one definitely opened up already. Yeah, definitely. Solo. This is why I, I realized yeah. kind of thing for the Martin guitar. Mahogany neck, it's a, I think it's a... Two piece neck, yeah, it's a two piece neck. Two piece neck. Open this, gear, right? Yeah, this is the open gear. Groover uh, open gear tuner. I don't know if you guys can see it, but yeah, yeah. Groover open gears. Yeah, they have the, these are the button type tuners. That's very vintage style. Mm -hmm. yeah, so I'm just going to put it forward and see you guys yeah. can see, but yeah, something like that. We've got some details at the back, bro. Don't this is actually. What kind of what line is it? Just it's, some... it's not like a wooden line of maple. Yeah. Very intricate because it takes time to do this kind of thing. Right. Yeah. Okay, see, it's yeah. pretty pretty clean. The book match, yeah. So this is uh, how much is going for? Uh, the... This retails are at four two five zero, four thousand two hundred and fifty dollars. Let's go play some things. Yeah, I think you play some. At least they still remember the sound. Dreadnought sound, bro. Yes, right? but this doesn't this have a lot of 
trebles, there's a lot of highs there. No, because Martins are known for having that very boxy wooden sound. It's oh. very traditional. The majority of the oh. Martins that I've tried, okay. this, this, they're famous for this kind of sound. Okay, I'm going to try this now. Uh, I'm going to try with the pick now. So, okay. let's see. Sustain and all, but very just a bit of a boxy sound. Boxy sound, yeah. yeah. Depends the kind of music that I'm playing. If, I, yeah. if we're going to be playing an evergreen style, like very Bob Dylan ish kind of music, I think this is the kind of guitar, the Rolling Stones kind of. So, we're going to feature another guitar, uh, so called Same Specs. Uh, yeah, the Same Specs. With the letter M. All right, so, this is a Martin, and this is the Maestro. If only we have Maton, we bring Maton also, because M, all M, you know, yeah. but now we don't have. So, so this is M and M. Eminem, Eminem, Martin and Maestro guitars. But both of these like, have the same shape. Eddie Rondex Cruz top for you guys stop. wondering. This, uh, but with the same Indian Rosewood, but Indian Rosewood. check out the difference here. Ah, alright, okay, uh, okay. The book match. -hoo -hoo. This one has a bit more details. Uh, yes, a bit more expression on the Expression of the green. Very yeah. nice expression of green. And the lines also like, have a bit of. Uh, this is a. Um, this is an abalone. Abalone, right? Yeah, this abalone. is an abalone strip that we have nice. going on. Okay. DIR. DIR. Yeah. D means for dreadnought. IR means for Indian rosewood. Right. Ebony bridge and ebony fingerboard. Yeah. Oh, these are rosewood pins. Rosewood these are pins. Not, uh, bone pins. These are rosewood oh, pins. Okay. okay. Right. Yeah. Um. The rosette also has uh, the rosette. Yeah, it's wooden. Pins. Yeah, it's an abalone rosette. It's, I think it's a two mm abalone rosette. Mm. Yeah. I think about two or four, I can't remember, but two or four. And then we have um, a purfling, abalone purfling as well. Right. Really nice. Oh, and binding. this is a wooden Plus. binding. So this is a wooden binding. This is right? a maple binding. Right, yeah. Can yeah. Tell by so by, by I feel mm. guitars with wooden bindings actually do last longer. All right. So far, I have not heard any uh, binding problems. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, none. For, actually, to be honest, unless. Yeah. It's, unless Unless it's a very old batch of Maestro's, so those SD mm. series, yeah, probably you might hear of it. Mm. You remember our good friend, Mr. Ao Cheng? Yeah, yeah. He Ao has Cheng. an SD3 CE. I, I think he's still playing, man. Yeah, he's, no, he's, he's coming back to us. For to, the setup, right? To do a, a refret. Refret, oh, okay. Because wow. the pickup is gone. It's the okay. old B Bang, which right. you got the guys know that's kind of phased out in the market right now. Mm -hmm. His binding is still okay. His it's binding is still okay. Right? Binding is still okay. Is it a wood binding? Uh, no. Oh, it's then a, it's a it's plastic a, binding. It's a plastic binding. I think that means the problem is the glue. Remember, probably the, so the I think type of glue used to yeah, be different. Yeah. So I'm not too sure. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's what I feel. So, right. benefit of a doubt here. Yeah. Like, or maybe just Cheng really takes care, you know, good care of his guitar. Like, you know, and his humidity, ah, everything. Cheng really plays his guitar. He really <laughs> whacks his guitar, man. <laughs> if you guys should check him out, they, uh, last night I saw him on Shopee Live. Right, right. He was right, using right. The, our original the series. New, the new guitar. The new guitar. Was, uh, yeah, I was like, yeah. wow. Yeah, mahogany. Yeah, he mahogany. was really happy, I don't know. Right. Anyway, so yes, coming back to this. Um, I mentioned Ebony Fingerboard, Ebony Bridge. Don't forget the headstock, bro. Uh, very, this is a different. slotted headstock, if you can see. Yeah. I think only happens for traditional series. Traditional series, we actually have a slotted headstock and we do have a, a top loader. I call it top loader. Yeah, so flat one. Uh. Flat ones. Right. Okay, for the machine head wise, these are using Grovers as well. Mm -hmm. uh, these are like the button like, jelly button like chewing mm. packs. Yeah. Uh, string wise, for maestros, all maestros from the traditional series, original series, private collection, custom series, or even BTO models, they come equipped with Elixirs. Elixirs 12, are, right? Elixirs 12, nano web, phosphor rods. Okay, you play first, let them hear. Okay, the sound. These guitars are all tuned. <laughs> thing about Maestro guitars, um, this, which everybody knows, famous for their overtones. It still has that traditional sound, yeah. but it has that bit of overtones to give it right. that modern kind of yeah. twist. To I'm going to try it off with the pick. 
Okay. Dreadnought has always been my favorite. I've been wanting to change the shape of my guitar, but I don't know, I still go back to Dreadnought. Overtones, man. Over How much is this going for, for the maestro? Oh, this baby here. This baby here. 2.5. 2.5. <laughs> yeah. So both have no pickups. Of course, you can uh, install no pickups, yeah. the one. 2.5, 4250. I mean, two types of uh, brands here we have. Yeah. Same shape. So which one you prefer, you you decide. If you guys are hardcore, hardcore Martin fans, logos, yeah, we have the. We have this now. Have this now available at the shop. Right. Uh, we'll be listing it soon on the TGS our website. Because once we put it on the website and people see it and they will just click it, you know, at home and just buy it and you cannot try it. Already. Yeah, so and the rival will message me, yeah, please pack the guitar. I'm like, <laughs> okay. But then we, we not only have this uh, D28 that just came, we also have another guitar, maybe we'll feature it on the next video. Yeah. So, yeah, thanks for watching and then uh, we'll see you on the next video. Yeah, we'll see you on the next video. Alright. TDS GOTD. Can someone please press stop.